Thank you. It's great you came out for homecoming. You look happy, Dad. Well, it's been a tough couple of years, but we have some good news. Mm -hmm. The company hired me back. When? Middle of the month. That's why we called you and told you we were coming down. We wanted to celebrate together. Yeah, construction's picking back up again. Finally. Mm -hmm. Had to take a pay cut, but at least I'm working. And with both of us working, we're just fine. So, how's school, Sam? It's great. It's smart you're getting into IT, Sam. Bernie Myers was unaffected by the construction downturn. He took my laptop when I was let go and issued me a new one when I was hired back on again. That's good, Dad. But I'm not going into IT. Oh? It's related to what I'm studying, but IT deals more with hardware and software. What I'm studying is called MIS, or the Management of Information Systems. You mean you'll manage IT people? <laughs> not exactly, Dad. Do you use project management software at work? Yeah, Open Enterprise. Okay, IT has set you up with a computer and they installed your management software. Those are the first two elements of an information system, the hardware and software. But those are of no use without the other three elements. And what other elements? Well, like I said, hardware and software are the first two elements. The third is... Yes, okay. Here's a model of our information system. Your IT is delivering your hardware and software. Now, imagine that our glasses are fully loaded computers. Even with the software installed, it's not useful. What's missing? Beer? No beer. We have a long drive home after that game. Uh, what's missing is soda. Diet soda. Yes, soda is the data. And just like your laptop with management software, it's useless without the data. Data is the third element. Now this server is full of data, which brings us to our fourth element, procedures. You know, Dad, the instructions that tell us how to do what we do? Data is the bridge between the hardware software side of an information system and the procedures people side. You know, the bridge between the humans and the computers. But how do we manage all this data? We could all lean over and sip out of it with straws, or we could distribute it to the glasses where we, the people using the information system, can decide to drink it directly from the glass, use a straw, or just not use it at all. People are the final element in an information system. I'm learning how to plan and manage the data, procedures, and people. So it's, it's like my job. I enter the cost and schedule data into the project management software, and then I make sure that the people involved in the project get their jobs done on time. Seems simple enough. Ah, Shush, I'm sure it's a lot more difficult than that. No offense, Dad, but that's just a small system with a specific function. When I'm working on a new information system, I need to think in particular ways. Systems thinking helps me model inputs and outputs of the information system itself and understand how it relates to other systems. And abstract thinking helps me diagram a business process and understand the purpose of the system I'm designing. I do not understand. Okay, before we can even figure out the hardware and software we need, we need to figure out the purpose of the information system and the data we need to collect. For instance, marketing needs different data than operations, and even when the data is shared, one department may need to use it differently than the other. Form follows function. Exactly! I am just so happy that you're excited about what you're learning. Know what excites me most? It's what I can do with an information system. I can model an inventory management system for a chain of specialty boutiques that buys fashion from around the world and sells it in malls across America. You know, everything in business is connected. But unlike learning a trade, the thinking skills I'm developing will always be valued and can be applied to any type of business. Now that sounds like job security. Well, our hardware's empty, so would you like to manage the data? <laughs> nah, just dig in. 